Oh no, where did you go there? What? Mm -hmm. There's a fly that I want to murder. Yeah. Besides that, hi everybody, welcome to the Gallifrey Gals Get <laughs> Unhinged slash Brit. <laughs> I said, we should call this Gallifrey Gals Get Brit. Brit. Which, my, whatever. You know, whatever. Um, We'll shop it. We'll shop it around. We'll see what you think. We'll shop we'll, it around. We'll, we'll, we'll like we'll um like audience test it. We'll focus group it. You know. We'll um give us your feedback. Let us know. What do you think? Um, we have had yes some patrons in our twenty dollar tier. Um, and also I think I think some also just recommendations from our friend as well. Um, Firefly uh, and from our friend in all of the above. Yes. Firefly of some older british shows that we might be able to check out because they were not produced by companies who are under the contract yes. that sag is striking against yes which means like the 70s too we could watch them mm -hmm. uh some of them are yeah uh, this is the one we have pulled up right now is from the 80s i believe but um so we have a, a variety of like one or two episodes of a bunch of different shows and we're gonna do a little smorgasbord platter of things see what we like see what you like and then see if there's something we, we might want to watch in a more see continuous way um during this strike and who knows if we really love it then beyond who could say but yeah the first one we're starting with is because my best friend who is british was like oh this is one of my favorite shows of all time and i was like oh yeah you have talked about this before and so um, here we are so here we are, and this is a show called Red Dwarf. I we know don't know anything about, about it. it. Yeah. Um, Just the, like, two cents we were given. My friend did tell me that it can be a bit lads. So we'll... Little, um, little lads, little crass, maybe. We'll, we'll see about that. But um, he says, especially once you get past the first season, this is what everyone says, right? Uh, it's yeah. really, really good, supposedly. <clears throat> so yep. we're going to give it a whirl. It feels on brand, right? Because it's sci-fi. Yeah. And, uh, and it's British. So, yeah, I guess we're going to watch this and see. We literally know nothing about it. So Not a, not a literally not a, not a fucking thing. This is the um, first episode. It's called The End. The End? Okay, I didn't even know the so title. Amazing. It's kind of a funny thing to call your first episode. Uh, this is the end of the, the show as we, as know, we it. know it. Uh, the so, end of the show as we know it. And I feel nothing because I don't know. So let's go. <laughs> yeah, we're gonna watch the Red Dwarf as we get uh, Brit. Oh, it's not great. I'm sorry, bro. No, it's but okay. Get, it's it's only good if you're like real southern when you say because it it's get Brit, get Brit, Gallifrey gals get, get Brit. Brit, and that's fun too because a get is a thing you can call someone. That's like British slang, you know, like, hey, you get. Ooh. So there you go. Get, okay. get. All right, I'm done. Let's just watch. Let's watch a show and see if we like it. Yeah. <laughs> yes, sir, up and around. Mister, have you ever been hit over the head with a welding mallet? <laughs> no. It says a laugh track? Or a live audience? <laughs> That's got to be a laugh track. <laughs> Lister, shut up. Only or maybe don't. not. I don't understand that we had such a. Mister, don't crumb and don't make any stupid sounds with your cheeks. We had such a dramatic opening, and now we're in like <laughs> SNL or something. Mister, yeah, very different vibe. <gasps> Maletto. It's a replicator. Chicken soup. Yep, that's working. <laughs> all this maintenance business. Mm. Mister, last time I only failed by the narrowest of narrow margins. You what? You walked in there, Rose. I am a fish. 400 times with a funny little dance and fainted. That's a total lie. I try and respect Rimmer and everything, but it's not easy because he's such a smeg head. <laughs> Did you hear that, sir? Oh, Rimmer. <laughs> you are a snakehead. Aww. Oh, oh, 
Rimmer. Shit! I now commend his ashes to the stars he loved so much. Why do I feel like this isn't gonna go well? Yeah, really. I guess he's Welsh. There's a Wales flag on the ashes canister. This is a piece of music he specially requested. <laughs> I did not know this was going to be. I did not know at all. I did not think that's what was happening. Apparently, Rude. this is a live audience. I've been told. Okay. So. Wow. Holy shit. I'm just saying, you know, if you can't pass fair and square, why bother? Well, you would, Lister, because you've got no ambition, no drive. You're just gonna cheat? ...to be the lowest rank on this ship. I'm not the lowest rank on this ship. What about the laboratory mice? <laughs> Tell those mice to do something, you've got to jump to it. The welcome back George McIntyre reception is about to begin in the refectory. George says... Ah, oh, what a... Woo! Especially those who weren't able to attend his funeral. <laughs> the welcome back George McIntyre? Wait a minute, what does that mean? What? Especially those who weren't able to attend his funeral. Wait, what's happening? Yeah, I'm confused. Sadness for the passing away of George and joy because George is back with us, albeit as a hologram. <laughs> what? Not have traveled with a hologram. This so is like such a stunt. Like is parody. Like George. Oh my gosh. And George's knowledge and experience. I don't want you to think of me as someone who's dead. <laughs> More as someone who's no longer a threat to your marriages. <laughs> yeah. I, I think Joe knows what I'm talking about. Oh my gosh. Lads, lads, you know, lads, lads. Holly's only capable of sustaining one hologram. Mm. My advice to anyone more vital to the mission than Holly? If you die, I'll kill you. Any of this mean I've covered my body in complete and utter and total absolute nonsense gibberish. Yeah, dude. Yes, you have. <coughs> Theorem multiplied by two of the x-axis minus one equals the total velocity of Red Dwarf, which means I know everything about astro engineering. Good morning, Lister. That's probably the last time. Hmm. Dry up, Lister. Oh. With entrance for the engineer's examination. Now make their I wonder what the oh, non-human life form on board is going to be. Oh, kitty. Yeah, what is it? A cat in here. Non-human life form. <gasps> <gasps> oh, dude. Milk that isn't good for cats. Mess. And yes, don't give your cats dairy. Oh, look. Oh, that poor cat. Oh, does not want to be held. And also, you wear full body suits. I mean, I guess you wanted to cover up your arms because you're covered in a bunch of yeah. sheets. He also has like different like highlighters or sharpies or whatever in every little pocket. Pocket. Oh, dude, you're smudging. You're smudging. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh. Yeah, he did. He. Yep. You're never, dude. <laughs> Aww. Aww. Poor guy. Just suppose we, I did have a cat. Just suppose. Just suppose. What would you do with Frankenstein? Well, I'd have it cut up and test run on it. <gasps> would you put it back together when you'd finished? <laughs> Lister, the cat would be dead to stasis for the rest of the trip and forfeit 18 months' wages. No. Holy shit, no. Over that cat? No. Haven't you ever traveled in Stella? No. Oh, you don't feel a thing. The stasis room creates a static field. <gasps> He's just gonna this go into it. stasis. Pass through lead. Time cannot penetrate the stasis field. So, although you exist, you no longer exist in time. And oh my gosh, it's gonna be like. So what's happened after eighteen months? Dave, it is now safe for you to emerge from stasis. They're dead, Dave. <gasps> what? Bullshit. Everybody, Dave. What? Todd Hunter. Is that? No, Bullshit. stop. That's Everybody their ashes. Dave. Why is it so dirty? Right That's now? them. Is this stuff? That is catering officer Olaf Peterson. Why do you keep putting it in your mouth, dude? No, that second technician rumor. Oh, yeah. I didn't recognize him without his report. Oh, book. my gosh. What was Rimmer doing in the drive room? <coughs> he was explaining to the captain why he hadn't sealed the drive <gasps> plate properly. Three million years. Three million years? What? <gasps> the hologram. Uh... 
Long time no see. Oh my gosh. Yes, that's because I'm dead. Dead as a can of spam. I mean, you're dead, but you're not dead, dead because you're still here, aren't you? Listen, I'm not really here. I'm not really me. That would be you really see, weird. A simulation yeah. Me. That's me there, that pile of albino mouse droppings. Hmm. He's about to walk through something or whatever. Yeah. Try to lit. You can tell he got a little outline around him. Oh, yep. Yeah. It's like you can tell when they're about to transport in TNG. Ooh. Or classic who. Yeah. <gasps> what? I'm sorry. Is this the cat? Look at his tea. Better make myself look big. What are we watching? I don't know. I was fearsome. He evolved from cats. Oh, oh what? My gosh. He is this is so weird. This is bonkers. Frankenstein, yeah. I remember that stuff from kitty school. Oh my gosh. The promise land. Fushal. No, it's not Fushal, it's Fiji. And I will. Oh my gosh. Where we're going. Look out there. The slime's coming home. Oh my gosh. The beginning. And that's why this was called the end. Best theme song ever. In the sun, sun, sun. That what was the fuck did we just watch? Something. Did I hear you say when we were, I don't know, on or off camera that that's only six episodes? This is supposed to be six episodes a season. And I think <clears> it's like three seasons. Okay, well, I absolutely want to see the rest of we this first season. We have to watch more of this. Yes. I'm going to ask that it get, like we're going to get it recorded. Hopefully, y'all are super fucking down for this. I hope y'all are down to watch like, us watch Red Dwarf we because that do was this. bonkers. That was... Uh, uh, I wish I had no idea, honestly. I that thought it was a we were sitcom. about to watch a gritty... British space sci-fi show. I had no idea we were about to watch a sitcom. I had that no clue. So bad. No clue. Especially with the intro with them like painting. Yeah, the red I was, like, was like, well, okay, maybe this is just weird so it's, like, and cheesy. Silly. Yeah, it is weird and cheesy in a sitcom way. Okay, That's let me bonkers. see. Oh, this has. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. It has <laughs> five, six, seven, eight seasons of six to eight episodes each and then it looks like a a mini a, a three-part little mini series 10 years later holy shit and that's then, why it says 2017 okay yeah so it looks like from 1988 pretty consistently until 93 so that would okay. be six seasons and then so a season in 97 one in 99 and then the miniseries bit in 2009, and then a season in 2012, a season in 2016, a season in 2017. I don't know what that NA, and then in 2020, like, looks like movie, maybe. What did we just get ourselves into? I'm about to, um, so if you saw me like looking down at all during that, I was literally messaging my British best friend yes. uh, about this yes. during it to be like, wait, what? I'm sorry, what's happening? What the fuck? Um, so I'm texting him right now. That was bonkers. So that's how I found out it was taped in front of a live audience. Um, cause then so I was like, there's a laugh track. Cause this live was like, this is in front of a live audience. So that's, like, that's crazy. I found out. So that was our fan who helped me a little during that while we were watching. Crazy amazing 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 okay i well. understand so much more about his personality now having seen just this great i can't wait Matthew. i can't wait to see more of this insanity i'm so excited um hopefully y'all are for that too because we're in yeah what we're in okay well um you know how it goes. It's still the same at the end. If you want to help support the channel, especially through this time um, when it's a little different and difficult and mm -hmm. weird and all the things during the strike, um, you can sign up for our Patreon. Patreon.com slash Gallifrey Gals. Uh, we have a new tier lined up, much more simple, much more yep. accessible. And you can sign up for our $6 tier and get everything. You get full Besides, reactions. Besides like behind the scenes stuff. Full link reactions to all our, our Discord community. Yes. $10, you get all of that plus extra special bloopers goofs uh reactions to things like 
behind the scenes, behind the scenes uh, yeah. stuff like that. And then at $20 a month, you get access to our very special Um Actually channel in our Discord where you can tell us things that you, we got wrong when we were talking about an episode, facts with trivia we didn't know, your own theories about something that we are interpreting in an episode, suggestions for things, ask okay. us questions, and we're going to take all of that. We're going to respond to them in a video for those patrons every month, answer their questions, respond to their theories, thoughts, and corrections. And that's what you get for that. Bada bing, bada boom. And we greatly appreciate it. And also yeah. shout outs as well throughout. And yeah. if not, like, subscribe, comment. And, yes. and as soon as the strike's it. over, we'll be back to uh, Doctor Who, Star Trek The Next Regular Generation, programming. And all our other stuff. So, and Battlestar Galactica. So get ready. <gasps> oh, fuck. I already forgot. Hell yeah. See, and a surprise one that nobody knows about for after TNG. Mm hmm. <laughs> Lots All right, see you later, anyway. alligators. Bye, everyone. Uh, we'll catch you for gals next time as we... See you later, alligator. Forgot how irrelevant that was After right now. After a while, crack a duck a dial. <laughs> Bye. Which is so funny. Why? Hey, guys. Thanks so much for watching. If you liked this video, go ahead and give it a little thumbs up. And if you want to be notified when we post new content, go ahead and subscribe to our channel and hit that little bell in the corner.